My name is James Collex, and if you are finding me for the first time, I resell in between my normal nine to five job, so I can afford to buy nerdy stuff. If you're wondering why James has such a sexy voice right now, it's because I was in Prague all weekend, and on the very first night on Friday, there was a karaoke bar, and bearing in mind, I can't sing. Um, I was there for a very, very long time, and this is the best my voice has been since I got back. So without further ado, uh, it's Wednesday. I'm gonna try and hit up a charity shop as this is my first full day back at work. And then I've got some packing to do later on. in this one. They're all like cheap light stuff. Still, it's nice to get in one. My voice is still <sighs> We go back to the grind. Over in C4 we have sold a transformer. This should hopefully be, I need to tidy up this mess. I need to get him out. He's sold for 39.99 plus shipping. Going out via GSB to Italy. Back over this side again in D2 we have sold a calculator for 9 99 plus shipping. Bought from a charity shop a little while ago for I think two pounds. I got there in the end. Osborne and Little Wallpaper, 49 99 plus shipping. Hopefully they're gonna buy a lot more because I've got a lot more and it was hidden behind the death pile. Loot Crate exclusive cat dog scarf sold for 19 99 all in. Small parcel unfortunately. And just in case someone from Loot Crate is watching, where's my money and where's my stuff? You bunch of thieving a-holes and fingers crossed the last one of the day nintendogs dutch hound and friends 6.99 all in will just about go as a large letter not a lot to get f3 there should be an optimus prime funko pop unboxed which i spelled incorrectly in the listing it says it's unoxed oh, and that was 8.99 plus the shipping and then in a4 it should be a gundam figure which sold for 9.99 plus the shipping tutaku tekken 7 hiachi mishima 9.99 all in cost me three pound massive dud another loot crate scarf 19.99 all in now this next item is not skewed but i think i know where it is ah fucking balls 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 it's in my toe ah you face ball face Oh, my little toe. Well, the game that I thought was here, uh, it turns out it's not. Turns out I'm an idiot, but most of you knew that already because it's in there. But there we have it. Vampire the Masquerade Redemption Big Box PC 44 99 all in can't remember if it's gsp or not it's been a very very long day 13 49 all in for this one iko collector booster pack in japanese 98 to go now to try and package everything between now and then it's bedtime it's quite nice is that brand new attacks it's nice to it's a medium hmm so i'm thinking of the t-shirt for myself i normally require Long Boohoo Man. No. It's three pound fifty an item. DS, in case I presume it's going to be empty. Yeah. If it was mint, I'd probably pick it up. But it's not, so I won't. Fishing reel feels cheap, three pound. Those little knickknacks. Why has someone opened it? I bet there's some horrible person is nicked out on like one card. Okay, just got a peek of the games, and I bet they're all crap. Prevo, blank discs, rugby, rugby, sing star, cr uh, cricket, f terrible. Wally. PS4 game with oh, it's FIFA 15. 
Mm. Vintage comedy. One pound. And I've covered the barcode. Thanks for that. I think it might just be the shirt for today. Not been here for a while. And I can confirm. We have games. Age of Empires. And Rise of Legends. At least only... What was that? 30p for 50p. 50p. Oh, I've got to try and find Coldplay again. Nope. Oh, where's Coldplay? It's got to be in the summer. There we go. No one's bought it still because it's £35. This charity shop is just dead. What is this? What is this? Hold the front door. Dungeons and Dragons. I mean, there's no price on it, which it feels very light, actually. Oh, because nothing's in it. It's all on the side. It's all up here. Is there a date on it? Are you selling a big Dungeons and Dragons? Um, that is a good question. Because it's just sort of everywhere. Oh, are we? Okay. £25 apparently. Right, okay. I mean, it's expensive, but I believe it to be complete. £25. It's in very good condition. I'd rather pay a tenner, but I've not picked up a lot. I've got to try and get a video somehow, and this is going to be it. Well, this is my very small and humble haul for the week. So we've got uh, these pictures up today. Nice pair of Ralph Lauren uh, like chinos for four pound fifty. Would imagine about twenty, thirty quid back for that. And then Dungeons and Dragons. Now, there's a couple of reasons why I picked this up. I mean, yes, it was expensive, and admittedly, if this was at a car boot sale for twenty five pound, I wouldn't have paid twenty five pound. Let's be honest. I think I would have walked away and just laughed. I bought it because we've got Stranger Things coming up on E24. So I'm hoping that there'll be a trailer that will drop for that. And this has obviously got some sort of a dragon in it. There has been hints that the big, big bad or the next big bad of Stranger Things is going to be a dragon-based enemy. And the chances are we're getting blackouts this winter. So I think a game like this that would work via candlelight is potentially going to be very, very good. So it's all complete. The box is in good condition. I'm going to aim higher. I'm going to put up for about... 50 60 quid but yeah if this was at a car boot itself i would have laughed and sworn at the camera about how obscene their prices were just goes to show i'm a massive hypocrite totally forgot about this and um this is how it's arrived yeah it was hanging on by a thread but it's in the top loader and it is xerneas there we go xerneas ex now this was 11 pound 50 all in it did get here in one piece and i think that actually might be that set complete 